Um, the Preakness this year is very interesting with the Philly. Rachel Alexander is a superstar Philly, but she's going to run against 12 Colts this time instead of Philly. But you have to respect her and like her. But I would say I like Bob Baffert's horse, Pioneer of the Nile, is who I would say is the horse to beat. But it'll be a great race to watch. I think it's going to be a great Preakness. I'm excited about watching Rachel Alexander against the boys. But I think Gary Stute's got the right idea with Papa Clem. Uh, I think the horse is really coming into his own. The, the Derby was a good race, not a great trip. Uh, his dad did it with Snow Chief, so why can't he do it with Papa Clem? I think that would be a great story for racing. Well, she just looks like an unusual filly. I just, if, they, if she does run against the Colts, I hope she has a good day. Because uh, my feeling about running silly against the Colts is if they have a bad day, they won't beat the Colts. But if they have a bad day, they'll still beat the filly. I mean, that's just my opinion. I'm going to go with Big Drama, a new shooter with Johnny Velasquez. Uh, got a little bit of speed. I think Rachel Alexander coming back in two weeks. I don't know about that. And and the you know the Derby winner in the slop, he's not going to get that Saturday. So we're going to go for a new shooter in Big Drama. Yeah, well, I like the Philly, Rachel Alexander. You know, I know he's against the boys, but nothing wrong with that. She runs so impressive and so nicely. And the rider, I guess he, he knows what he's talking about, I think. And it's not an easy race, but uh, I stay with her. I like my horse because he's training good. He you know, like the last track, last time he won the Kentucky and he know, like the track. And then when he said he's training super, and then he walking yesterday very good. And I'm happy on it. If it were up to me and I had a contender and I knew she showed up for the race, I really in my heart would say to myself, I really should scratch. I mean... This filly, she's just unbeatable. She's coming back in two weeks, but it doesn't matter. She just breezed to the front. She was the easiest kind of winner, and uh, she's very special. The three-year-olds running this year are competitive, but she's, she's something special, so I never want to run having to contend against somebody special. They should all stay home.